Hello, my name is Thomas Bocek and this is a quick overview over Bookmark Tom. It's a bookmark saver, which is a browser extension designed to synchronize bookmarks between your local browser and your WebDAV server. And for WebDAV, I'm going to quickly show you how it works for WebDAV. I'm using the following provider. It's called Wilkly. There is a free tier, so that's what I've been uh, using. Now, I already prepared a folder. I call it config test. It's at the moment empty, so we will need to create a file here. But before, we want to first install it. So there is this add-on page. It's linked in the GitHub page. So we can add this to Firefox. Say, okay, now we have it here. Now configure it, manage extension. We have our preferences. So what we need to add here is the URL, username, password, and the interval check so how often i want to check the remote web dev to see if there are any changes so by default i leave it to 10 minutes so i will load the config here it can be downloaded and load again so i don't have to enter it all the time since i synchronize with nextcloud all my files anyway so this is my config file for the provider Wilkly. As I already mentioned, I can load this. This is my setup here um, and my, my username. I can test it. We see connection successfully. Now we can start to synchronize our bookmarks. I also tried to run this bookmark add-on on my mobile phone on Fennec. Unfortunately, here it doesn't work since the API, the bookmarks API is not implemented. And also I'm using Volvic, which is a version for my uh, MetaQuest 3. Here I have the same issue. The API, the bookmarks API is unfortunately not supported, so I cannot sync the bookmarks to my MetaQuest 3 or to my Android device. So let's add some bookmarks. We add two folders here. Let's place here a news. Uh, let's add this bookmark here. We already have it. Let's put another one in and we'll have a uh, new folder add folder called sub uh, in the news let's add the following site here and then we have a folder where i currently teach and add two sites here the first site and the second site and now here we have all the links that will be inserted we can click on proceed and um, when we go here we see there's a new version and uh, when we go to my windows machine uh, this machine here i already installed it and i can then click on sync that means it will fetch the data from WebDAV and we see here some incoming changes. This will update my bookmarks locally. Let's say proceed and now we have the bookmarks and we also can add here a new folder. Let's call this test. We can add here this bookmark as well. Uh, we can even change the place to put it in the middle here and uh, we can then proceed to persist this in webdoff in bookmark.json so 
uh, here we would see now this is the latest version if we click on sync we would see an update uh, but we want to do a concurrent modification so we add a folder let's say hello save it and then it will try to sync and see um, okay there is an insert of hello but um, I don't have test and Arch Linux so that's going to be deleted on the remote because it's not in here but I say okay I don't care let's merge that means this will be inserted in my local bookmarks and hello will be uploaded so it will be merged we click on this and then we see here um, the saved version and then we can see hello test and everything's working we go back here and if we synchronize we will get the hello here as well this is incoming i say proceed and now we have the hello i can also delete bookmarks uh, delete 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 again and uh, let's say proceed remove everything now it's gone we have to currently this version here we go to sync and then it will ask do i want to delete this i say no this is actually good so i can say proceed merge do not delete and it will uh, then try to upload it so this will go from my machine to uh, webdoff and say yes proceed and although i removed it um, because i didn't remove it on my webdoff folder i still have it here uh, I, here we see the file and we can actually go here again sync and then we see some incoming links we say yes and then we have the bookmarks again that's um, how it works so um, i have to have this um, insert deletion since the api of firefox and also chrome is not that suitable for synchronizing and uh, merging bookmarks because the key is not exposed or the id is not exposed so that's why i have always to present it to the user as insert and remove.